get some practice get some practice get some practice one day two day three day in this way it will be your habit because habit is the key to your better life better future well it's me Silas. welcome to my channel sbrc infosys nepal so if you are new to this channel please go to the description you will find the link to our playlist and other video are uploaded in this playlist well guys in the in this eighth video of front-end development i'm gonna teach you about some important and interesting part about form in in this tutorial we'll uh, we will cover a uh, combo box single and multiple selections radio button password field text field label email field and uh, number field message box etc let's start in our computer disk okay guys now we are in our computer screen open any text editor like sublime text uh, then you can open any uh, like this new then here uh, you can type the project name form dot html i have written here dot html it is as dot html is the file extension name okay guys uh, type here some basic co uh, code of html then title here i'm typing here uh, form then under the body you can type here all visible code it um, okay then type form then under the form tag you can type here or uh, what you want like um, i want to enter your first name enter your enter first name name then type input input type is our text let's see how is it let's see okay guys how it's looking wow looking so beautiful yeah uh, this one is completed then here uh, i'm going to type um, input type is text uh, then you can say the name here a uh, name like f name uh, in this way uh, i'm going to break the line uh, okay guys then you can copy it i'm going to copy and paste here then i'm just um, edit it uh, like uh, first one is uh, first name then um, second one is last name all is same and uh, this name is L name the next one is um, enter um, your age okay enter your age um, yeah uh, F name here uh, you can type age then uh, next one is input type for submit button uh, input type is uh, uh, submit as you be um, it shall uh, then here you can type um, a name what you want to see on browser otherwise you can if you don't type this then it's okay yeah there is so near i'm going to give some gap by break line we are tag we are tag just for understanding okay there is good uh, enter your first name like uh, silas is my first name then last name is rokai then here you can type uh, age uh, for example 23 then you can submit then data will post here 
Yaf name is Silas, last name is Rokai, then age is 23. Yeah. If you type like uh, text, then it will be post. But this is an error. Um, if we need to only uh, take number, then you can change the type, not text. Type the uh, number. Then refresh it. Let's try. Mm. Mm, let's try number uh, 23 then it will be post okay if you want to type alphabet it will not support it then if you yeah. and guys also you can set the minimum value and maximum value for age uh, like um, 20 no 15 okay 15 minimum age is 15 and maximum age is for example 50 15 and 50 um, yeah when I put here uh, age uh, in integer like uh, 14 then it will be there is uh, some validation uh, value must be greater than or equal to 15 uh, so I need to um, set when I more than yeah this is must be less than it, it or equal to 50 not more more than 50 yeah 50 is post under 50 or equal to 50 will post till 14 and guys when you remove to form tag then it will be okay but um, there is some problem um, data will not post yeah let's try uh, first name silas last name rokai then here is uh, age something 23 Mm, let's try it submit it but there is no submit there is so that you must have to uh, write uh, form form tag you must write Okay, guys. This one is when you click here, then label, then auto select. Uh, if I need to that, then um, you must to you must add the label button like the, uh, like this. I'm going to show you. You can flow me, guys. Uh, right level then for uh, you can type your id name or i'm going to show you then close the uh, label then here if uh, you can type id id is equals to uh, you can type here what you, you want uh, id name i'm going to type uh, l, l name uh, first name yeah f name um, F name then the ID and this one is uh, must be same otherwise it will not working uh, let's try it refresh it then when you click here then auto select it but here is not working um, so you must uh, have to write this code for auto select when you click on label button label text uh, okay real name last name 
Mm, okay, this one is too much gap. And we have to change the name. Uh, then close label. Then here you have to uh, add the ID. ID is first to uh, L name. Okay. And next here close it. Then here uh, ID is goes to what adds. Let's see. Refresh it when you tap here auto select it here is also working wow there is some problem guys <laughs> yeah i think there is a id problem uh yeah here is f name so it's auto selected here you must have id and this one is must be same okay replace it let's try yeah auto select that's one good that was so beautiful uh yeah looking so beautiful then let's try it mm, okay copy paste i'm going to copy and paste uh, to i'm going to just eat it uh now i need to um for example email then enter your uh, email yeah enter email then you have to uh, type you have to must you must have to type its email otherwise it will uh, accept all type of uh, email so you must have email type then id is same and okay uh, next one is passport uh, for passport and here is also tab is must be a uh, passport otherwise uh, if you uh, change the type uh, uh, like the text it will be all passport will be sold so you have to uh, type this passport here is this one is unnecessary I'm going to remove it and ID is like this passport yeah this one is done yeah let's try let's see wow wow this is so beautiful yeah when you type here then auto hit height like this to be so i know when you uh, in this email field when you type uh, for example uh, sales only then submit it then it will be shows the error um, of it, this is the some validation uh, you must have at the rate that something something dot com you have you must have otherwise it will not be submitted yeah when I say the at the rate gmail.com then it will be submitted uh, otherwise it's not working it shows the some validation error if you type here uh, uh, like a uh, text in passport field then it will not um, like good uh, all data will shows so passport you must be secure so that you have to try this always be passport or passport yeah okay guys <clears throat> let's add, add a, another one uh, for example mm, enter uh, mm, what okay enter your uh, gender yeah oh, for male and female to so, yeah type is radio you have to radio button because uh, we have you know, two multiple selection 
uh, we have to select only one uh, male or female so that we have to um, set the type is radio then here you can let's break the data yeah. uh, when you type here for example input type first to radio uh, let's see what is this? yeah there is two tick option two radio option but there is no any text what is this uh, male or female then you have to say the male and female like here um, first one is for male second one is for female replace it yeah this is looking like this when you click to male and female both are selected but we must uh, we need to only one select male or female then you have to say the uh, name uh, send uh, for example name is Jen G E and Jen. Yeah. Refresh it when I click male. When I click female auto select auto remove male. Only one select. If I select a male, there is gender is first to on. When I click female, gender is first to on. But it is not clear to which one is male and which one is female. So that uh, you have to set the value um, for male uh, value is first to male for male then value is first to female uh, for female uh, to identify the who which is the ma male and which is which one is female yeah let's see replace it or uh, male then submit gen equals to male when you select female then gender is equals to female yeah this one that was so beautiful yeah they were working mm -hmm. okay next one is i'm going to show you text area uh, text area for um, your message box uh, when you if you want to some message box like this um, okay message box then it will be shows like this this one is a message box um, let's break it yeah then if you want to uh, increase or reduce the size as for required then you can set them um, in pixel codes and row like this codes if you for width and rows for height Roads like um, for pixel is like this, yeah. Rows for height and calls for width. Let's see. Yeah, some gaps. This one is also beautiful. Let's see. Inter, inter month. Um, for we need to combo box for multiple selections um, like a month January, February, March, April to select it uh, here it's option it's goes to Jen and next one is option is 
February, January, February. Next one is March. Mm, and next one is option mm, January, February, March, April, APR, April. Next one option is uh, May. In this way, you can um, set all 12 years as per required. Here is if this one is uh, single selection option. Just break it. Yeah. Jan, Feb, March, April, May. When you select it. February, there is post February. I'm selecting March. Then this one is March. But uh, sometimes uh, I need to select multiple data like this. You can set here. You can see multiple data, Jan, Feb, like this. Then you can uh, set the size. How many data will show by default? Three, four, five. You can set here like this. Three, three data will uh, default by default show, and you can send also like um, two. Then replace it. Two data only selected. like four in this way you can set the size then you can also select the multiple data like january february uh, by clicking the control button jan and feb here is month is cost to jan and next one is feb multiple data will select it thank you for watching the video guys if you are new to this channel please do not forget to subscribe our channel and if you are already part of the channel do not forget to practice every day and do not forget to share with your friend because sharing is caring if you enjoy this one i would like to say make sure to subscribe our channel to never miss update and hit that like button it will be motivate me to make new videos so Leave the comment below, hashtag challenge accepted and do practice every day.